Yo ho sha! What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joe Crew DMD, and today I'm going to explain to you how to get One Piece cards effectively. So here's the deal. Bandai games are always hard to get when they're popular. And when they're not popular, they're really easy to get, like a lot of other things in life. But with the One Piece card game, it's going to be popular because it's the most popular franchise in the world. It's the most popular manga. It's the most popular anime. So many people love it around the world. And so many people are going to try to get these cards. And it's really easy to say, oh, don't worry. You can just get the cards when they come out. No, you can't. And you've seen this with set one here. It happened with set one in Japan. It happened with set two in Japan. It's going to happen with every set here until, I don't know. I don't think it's ever going to stop happening. I think this game's going to be hype until, until ever. So... The way to get One Piece cards, if you want to get sealed product, is you have to pre-order. You have to, have to, have to pre-order. And the best way to pre-order is to pre-order when stores have their allocation windows open. Go to your LGS, talk to the person at your LGS, tell them that you want to pre-order and how early can you pre-order and make sure you're pre-ordering for that set. Right now, it's December 19th, the window just closed for set three. So set three is coming out probably in eight months, which means that pre-orders are happening now. Set two pre-order windows have already closed. Stores will put boxes up for pre-order, so you may be able to get them, but you wanna buy your cards before they release, because if you don't, you're not gonna have sealed product. Now, what happens if you can't get sealed product? Because now with OP01, you can't buy OP1 boxes, and if you do, you're paying way more than you should be for getting cards that are not worth that much, or if you wanna keep it sealed, that's a different story for your collection, that's fine, whatever. But it's really hard to get these cards right now, and it's nearly impossible to find packs. Targets are selling out, and when targets are selling out of blisters, that means that the packs are just extremely hard to come by. So the way to get cards is TCG Player. There's a website called TCG Player. You can buy open cards, you can buy singles. The cards for this game are cheap. They're cheap as heck, but the sealed stuff is getting expensive. So don't go and buy the sealed stuff that's expensive, buy the singles. And you know, if you wanna keep a sealed box for your collection, it's fine to pay 150 bucks for a box and just keep it sealed. It may be worth more in the future, but I would recommend buying singles. Don't buy this game to just like open to get cards that you want to build your decks. Figure out which deck you want to play and buy singles. They're super cheap. If you want to buy a play set of all the commons and uncommons and rares in the set, it's probably not going to set cost you more than like 40 or 50 bucks. Like they're, they're really cheap. The SRs get a little bit more valuable, but it's really only two of them. So unless you're like blinging out your deck with alt arts, this game is super accessible. The cards are super cheap and it's super fun. There's a lot of really active communities. Locals are selling out. The tournament pack cards are going crazy, right? They're like, I heard that law is over like a hundred bucks. I don't know, I'm a little out of the loop on stuff. I still haven't even opened my tournament pack. I have my winner packs right here. There's these, uh, I got I got two winner packs and two participation packs. I've only been to two locals, but I got them here and I'm gonna, maybe I'll get another one today, we'll see. But um, yeah, do, just, buy singles that's the way to do it if you want to build decks if you want to play this game get the singles for the game don't try and buy sealed product to open the cards for your game and if you want to get sealed product make sure you pre-order it way on in advance uh there's a link i will put in here for pre-order for set three from greg's games that's where i order my cards from these days and if you use that link you can use my promo code joku10 and you can save 10 percent on your boxes um there's a limited number of boxes so they will sell out for the pre-order and then once those are gone you can't get them so if you're watching this video much much later i'm sorry they're probably already gone but if you're watching it right now they're probably available and you can go and pre-order and use my promo code and save a couple bucks but that's what you got to do you got to pre-order this stuff just do it even though i know it's hard to plan but if you want to have sealed product that's the way to do it and if you're complaining that oh these people bought up all the cards so i can't buy them anymore that's not really how it works because stores won't just sell all of their cards to one person you know if they do that's like crazy but you just pre-order you pre-order whatever amount you want i always have the cards that i want to open because i always pre-order i pre-order eight months before the second that these boxes came available to order i ordered everything that i wanted and that was that so um yeah pre-order your cards if you want to have sealed and buy singles if you want to play the game it's super super accessible it's super fun there's tons of local communities as i said um and yeah that's pretty much what this video is about i want you all to be able to play and get cards i'm i don't sell cards i don't get a kickback from greg's it's just i want people to be able to play the game at my stream release party i gave away an entire case and only kept the alt arts and let people keep all the cards because i want to build a community i want people to play um on another note 
I've been making some cards. You may have seen them on my YouTube shorts and some of my um, like custom leaders in my videos. And these are a couple that I'm particularly proud of that I wanted to show you guys here in this video if you stayed to listen to my whole spiel about um, pre-ordering cards. Um, this is my buddy James. I've been training him on how to do design work and I'm very, very, very impressed with this card he made. He did this kid design and it looks so freaking good, man. I, I did make a very small edit to it, which I'm not gonna say what it was, but I'm very proud of the growth that he's shown. And I think this card looks really, really awesome. Um, there is a custom kid leader that I've made. You can check it out on my YouTube shorts. I don't know if it's uploaded yet. Um, this is my favorite card that I've made. This art is by uh, Benjamin, uh, Prince it's, it's on Instagram if you look at my Instagram that's tagged in like a story or something but yeah I love his art I um, you know commission stuff from him regularly and this was really cool because this was actually the toy Zorro that I sent him and I was like yo I want you to make a illustration of this and he absolutely crushed it this is just such an insanely cool card and then what I did was um, this is a foiling technique I made up this is the ace uh, from the cover of the aces story but I, I hid the manga panel of Luffy saying I'm your little brother in the background you, you might be able to see it in the sunset I call this technique mirage foiling this is a new foiling technique I made up but yeah I've been printing a lot of cards and having a lot of fun with it but I am a dentist and I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip my dental tooth tip to you would be make sure to floss it's really important and flossing sucks that's why people don't do it so get yourself a listerine ultra clean flosser it's a little handled floss you stick it in your mouth use it once a day and switch out the head and just have it do it while you're watching tv or whatever stick it behind your ear when you're not using it floss as long as you can it's only gonna help you out keep your teeth in your mouth longer so you can smile and tell everybody how great your shiny cards are thank you so much and i'll see you guys next time